If there's a natural resource that life cannot do without, it's water. While some people worry about food and other materials, clean and safe water and access to it are the paramount worry for most of the Malawi's population. Malawi is blessed with the world's third largest fresh water lake, but ironically, very few people can access the drop from such a massive supply of water for consumption. Among the perennial rivers is Lintipe here in Salima district, which feeds into Lake Malawi. The lack of access to clean and safe water has forced the communities around this area to rely on this unsafe water. This untreated water is used for all domestic purposes, including drinking. After doing their rondly in this river, the women and children draw the water for all domestic use as they are more alternative. The lack of access to clean and safe water has forced the communities around here to rely on such unclean and unsafe water. This untreated water is used for all domestic purposes, including drinking. It may seem free water, fetched at no cost at all, but the price to be paid for using untreated water is dear. To compound it all, sometimes predator and prey meet at the river. As humans fetch water, crocodiles look for prey. It is a game of life and death. Ntonga village here in Salima district is barely two kilometers from the lake. But people have no access to water, not to mention of clean and safe water. Inendinekremesias Umtinjeo ndodi unagumukira. Nde azimai aganyamura ziti ni pamudu ena mapezika kutatelela kwa chula manja, chula miendo. Nde mavudo nde ambiri ndi ituwa mene tuku kumana na ujifuwaja mfuto la manzi. Umtinje mene muma mwazi wedo, antuwa masamba mo, kutunga muma zaku mwao, tima gawala ditu. Up the river, water is polluted by various agents which create fertile ground for the breeding of disease-causing and disease-spreading microorganisms. Masses still lack clean and safe water in spite of the huge volumes of the resource in the country's five lakes and its numerous perennial rivers. It is said water is life, and indeed it is. But with this kind of situation, water is a health hazard. The big question remains, for how long will the masses rely on such unclean and unsafe water while the fresh lake water flows freely? A large mass of water but a huge thirsty population.